Beyond just money transfer within Uganda, mobile-based money transaction service providers intend to deepen their services as seen in the service mergers with commercial banks. It's uh, be it international remittance, be it savings products, and uh, you know, the best people right now to give those products to its customers are the telecommunications operators. We've got, we've got the most amount of people that are operating in financial services. So, so we want to work with, uh, we want to work with uh, the banking regulator to do that. And that's going to drive the penetration. I think savings is important. There is yet some gray areas despite regulation of mobile money services, even as the sector speeds up. So the Bank of, the Bank of Uganda has, has no doubt having to review whether the, the, the regulation that, that is in place is appropriate for the growth of the industry. And I think the, what, it, what it's indicating, you know, if, if anything, if you look at the banking sector, if it had not been for mobile money, they would have, the, the, the extent of financial inclusion would have actually been very low. To date, there are more than 10 million mobile money subscribers with investment in millions of dollars by the telecom players to strengthen their services in this area.